This is the weather video for Saturday, February 6, 2021. Showers will move northward across the area today, but we dry out and start to warm up on Sunday. Shower chances move in late Tuesday and stick with us through Friday morning. Models have backed off the idea of wintry precipitation on Friday for now. We have a lot to cover, so let's dive straight into Zero Z Run of the GFS valid today at 3 p.m. Just a quick note, I am producing this video at 2 a.m. on Saturday morning. We'll be caught in between two frontal systems on Saturday that will keep our weather active throughout the day and into the late night and overnight hours. The day will start off dry for nearly all of central Alabama with the exceptions of locations along and south of the I-85 and US-80 corridors in the extreme southeastern parts. That moisture will lift northward through the day with showers becoming possible around the I-20 corridor in the mid-afternoon and just an hour or so later north of that. There will be no instability involved, so no thunder is expected. Highs will top out in the mid to upper 40s across central Alabama, while overnight lows will fall into the lower 30s to the lower 40s. We could see a dusting to right around one inch of light snow for the extreme portions of north Alabama, especially north of the Tennessee River and close to the Tennessee state line. Temperatures will drop below freezing, which may allow for snow accumulation to occur during a 12-hour window, starting from 6 p.m. tonight to 6 a.m. Sunday morning. Extra lift from the Cumberland Plateau may give a little boost to the snowfall in that region, which may allow for slightly higher amounts than expected. Temperatures will quickly rise into the 40s on Sunday, so any accumulated snow will quickly melt off. Clouds will be on the decrease throughout the day on Sunday, which will allow for a good bit of sunshine by the late afternoon hours. It will be warmer as highs reach the mid-40s to the upper 50s across central Alabama. We'll continue to stay in between two fronts on Monday and Tuesday. That looks to keep us mainly dry with above normal temperatures for early February. A few showers may creep up from the south into the southern parts of central Alabama late on Tuesday, but overall chances look small for now. Monday's highs will be in the upper 50s to the mid-60s, Tuesday's highs will be in the upper 50s to the upper 60s. Moisture values really start to rise across the area and showers will be possible during the latter half of your Wednesday. Cooler air will start to move in from the northwest as well as daytime highs will be in the upper 40s to the mid 60s from northwest to southeast. An active pattern continues into Thursday as moisture will continue to flow across the area keeping showers possible at times throughout the day. A surface low looks to form to our southwest and will eventually move into the northwestern corner of the state. That will really allow for a shallow pocket of cold air to settle in over central Alabama. At this point, all precipitation looks to stay all rain through midnight. Highs will be in the lower 40s to the lower 60s. It now looks like the deterministic GFS and European models are agreeing on a cold rain across central Alabama throughout the entire day on Friday. The GFS is showing all of the moisture out of the area by midday, with none of the rain changing over into freezing rain, sleet, or snow. Much of the same story with the European as it paints all of central Alabama dry by the midday hour. We are still very early in the game for Friday, and these models can very easily flip back to a wintry solution. Stay tuned with us through the weekend and into the work week ahead. Highs will be in the mid-30s to the lower 50s across the area. That will do it for today's video. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. Bill Murray will have the next video out on Sunday morning. I'm Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day and God bless.